Good evening, I'm Mary Jo Ola, wise beyond her years and a child of God. That's how family members described 12-year-old Tatiana James at a vigil today. The Fraser community continues to mourn after James lost her life in an accidental shooting. Memphis police say James and her older brother were playing with a gun inside of a car Tuesday when it went off. Local 24's Annette Pegler joined us live in the studio after talking with her family. Annette. Mary Jo, there was not a dry eye at the vigil as family, friends, and the entire Fraser community remembered Tatiana James's short life. The emotional ceremony centered around prayer for James and for her mother and brother, who are both charged in connection with her death. And we're praying now, Lord God, for the repose and the peace and the rest of little Tatiana, Lord God. We believe is well now with her soul, Lord God. We thank you. Katrina Blackshire broke down in tears as her pastor said a prayer for her 12-year-old daughter, Tatiana James, who tragically lost her life earlier this week. She was a middle schooler, but she walked like a high schooler. And most of all, she loved God. The Neighborhood Christian Center Tatiana's Camp hosted a celebration of life ceremony at the place where she was accidentally shot. It meant a whole lot because I have been knowing Tatiana since she was a newborn baby and me and her mother is good friends and is really emotional today. Memphis police say James's mother left a loaded gun unsecured inside of her car. Police say James and her 13-year-old brother were tussling with the gun when it went off. He never would hurt his sister, nothing in the world. He loved his sister. They play together every day. James's family and friends are relying on prayer to help them with this tragedy. We pour out our grief to you and praise you that on one glorious day, when all suffering is extinguished and love has conquered, we shall walk together again. And Blackshire faces negligent homicide and aggravated child abuse. She's out on bond tonight. Her 13-year-old brother, or James's 13-year-old brother, who was also in the car, faces re a reckless homicide charge. The family has asked for privacy as they prepare for Tatiana's funeral. Live in the studio, Annette Pegler, Local 24 News.